Niners running back Jarek McKinnon suffered another setback in his recovery. Um, John Lynch went on KNBR Radio and said this today, um, that McKinnon has been getting to the last step in his rehab process, and he keeps getting setbacks. Um, so, with McKinnon getting setbacks, I don't think the Niners are going to cut him now, but I say that he could very, very likely be cut uh, within the next month, depending on if um, if he continues to have these setbacks. Uh, because at this point, you know, we have Matt Britt and Tevin Coleman. Those are two starting caliber uh, running backs. Uh, I mean, so is Jarek McKinnon. Uh, but, you know, when, when, when somebody's keep continuously getting setbacks and – and he's kind of being the odd. He's Jared McKinnon is the odd one left out in the running back group. Uh, he came in towards ACL last season and wasn't able to play this whole entire season. Obviously, that's a season-ending injury, and his rehab process is not going as good as it should um, because he continuously keeps getting these setbacks, which is causing you know question marks uh, going into this season. Uh, so it blows for McKinnon because he really hasn't got a chance to shine um, in in the NFL on his own yet. Uh, the Niners signed him to a four year, twenty eight million dollar deal last last off season, uh, two two off seasons ago. Um, went down um, in September with a torn ACL. Uh, I believe it was actually right around this time uh, when he tore his ACL last year, but. It's just it's it's unfortunate that a player has to go through injuries, um, and 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 it's an it's a it's a bummer for McKinnon, uh, especially since you know he he wasn't getting the majority of carries in Minnesota, so you know we signed him to this contract. He's the number one running back. Instead, he tears his ACL, and now he's continuously having setbacks uh, that could possibly that could possibly affect his future as a Niner. So, who knows?